Hey everyone. Have you ever found yourself chatting with a charming guy and thinking, is he into me? Or am I just overthinking things? Trust me, we've all been there. But guess what? Today we're cutting through the confusion. In this video, I'm breaking down the 10 key questions a girl might ask when she's genuinely interested in you. These questions are not just small talk. They're filled with hidden meanings, like little clues in your favorite mystery novel. And as someone who has been on both sides of this, I can promise you there's a method to this madness. So let's decode the girl code together. But before we dive in, do me a favor. Hit that like button if you're already finding this interesting. And don't forget to subscribe for more deep, honest advice that actually works in today's modern dating world. And if you're feeling extra supportive, consider joining our channel memberships. Your support helps keep our content authentic, independent, and accessible to as many people as possible. Now let's get into it. What's your type? When a girl asks about your type, this is not just casual curiosity. In psychology, this taps into something called self-disclosure reciprocity. By asking about your preferences, she's hoping you'll open up and share something personal. But it's more than that. She's really asking, do I fit your ideal partner profile? It's her way of figuring out if she's your kind of person without being too obvious. Here's the kicker. If your response aligns with her personality, you might hear her say something like, wow, that sounds a lot like me. This isn't just a coincidence. It's her way of saying, I'm interested and I hope you are too. This question also helps her decide if pursuing you is worth it. If your type doesn't align with her, she has a graceful way out. But if it does, She might already be imagining what dating you could be like, from casual hangouts to something more serious. Two, are you seeing anyone? This one is a classic. On the surface, it seems like innocent curiosity, but in reality, it's a strategic move. She's trying to figure out if there's a no vacancy sign on your heart or if she has a chance to step in. If she responds to your answer with something like, wow, really? That's their loss. She's not just making conversation. She's subtly hinting that she sees you as a catch. And if she shares her own relationship status right after, that's her waving a green flag saying, I'm available too. It's a clever way to find common ground while opening the door for you to make a move if you're interested. Three, do you work out? Now, this question isn't just about fitness routines. It's about tapping into what psychologists call the halo effect, where positive traits like being fit can enhance how someone sees you overall. If she follows up with something like, it really shows, she's giving you a genuine compliment. But there's more. She might secretly be hoping you'll invite her to join you for a workout. It's a subtle way to turn a shared interest into a casual date. Four, what do you like to do for fun? Asking about your hobbies isn't just small talk, it's strategic. 
This question leverages the similarity attraction effect, which shows that we're drawn to people with shared interests. If she says something like, that sounds fun, I've always wanted to try that, she's not just being polite. She's looking for excuses to spend time with you and explore your interests together. It's also her way of envisioning what your life might look like together. Are your lifestyles compatible? Do your interests align? This is her gathering the pieces of the puzzle to see if you two could be a great match. Five, do you like to cook? When a girl asks this, it's not just about food, it's about compatibility. Cooking taps into social role theory, which suggests that skills like cooking are seen as attractive traits in a partner. If she says something like, you'll have to cook for me sometime, that's her way of hinting at spending more personal time together. She's imagining cozy nights in, sharing a meal you cooked, and seeing how domestic life with you might feel. Six, what's your ideal date? This question is all about visualization. When she asks this, she's encouraging you to paint a picture of your perfect date, one that, ideally, she's a part of. If she responds with, that sounds amazing, she's not just agreeing. She's mentally scheduling that date with you already. This question also gives her insight into your creativity and what makes you happy, helping her figure out how compatible your ideas of fun and romance are. Seven, what's your love language? This one dives straight into emotional intelligence. By asking about your love language, she's essentially asking for the cheat code to your heart. If she shares her own love language right after, it's her way of saying, this is how you can win me over. It's an intimate question disguised as casual conversation, helping both of you understand each other's needs in a relationship. Eight, do you believe in soulmates? Asking about soulmates is her way of exploring your views on love and destiny. If you share that you do believe, it signals to her that you're open to deep, meaningful connections. And if she says something like, I think I found mine, she's not being subtle. She's casting herself as a leading candidate in your love story. Nine, what's your biggest turn on? This question shifts the conversation to a more intimate level. By asking this, she's exploring your desires and seeing if they align with her qualities. If she responds with curiosity or playfulness, she's taking mental notes. This is her way of understanding what excites you and seeing if there's potential for a deeper connection. 10. Do you want to grab a coffee sometime? A coffee invite might seem casual, but it's actually a calculated move. Coffee is low pressure yet intimate, a perfect way to spend one-on-one -on -one time. If she adds, or we could do dinner if you prefer, she's giving you options, showing she's flexible and genuinely interested in getting to know you. There you have it, the 10 questions that go beyond small talk, revealing what's really on her mind. These aren't random. They're deliberate, thoughtful ways to gauge your compatibility, express interest, and hint at her feelings. If you found this video helpful, hit that like button, and make sure to subscribe to Stoic Mindset Oasis for more actionable dating advice and modern psychology insights. Got a story or question? 
drop it in the comments. I'd love to hear from you. And if you think a friend could use this, share the video with them. Until next time, stay confident, pay attention to the signals, and keep decoding like a pro. See you in the next video.